All right, Sienna, so we're watching your freestyle straight on, and we can see we have a little bit of an elbow bend. The hand's a little wide. Make sure you keep that hand a little bit closer to your body. But we do at least like to see that we have, we do like to see the fact we have a little bit of an elbow bend there, and that's really, really good. You also do a great job of entering right at shoulder width apart with your fingertips down. That's excellent. Head position is in the right position. All that stuff is exactly what we want to see. Good kick out there. Now here you can see the straight arm recovery, right? We don't want to have that straight arm recovery. One of the reasons why we do that zipper drill a lot is because we like to have high elbows. We like to see shark fins throughout the water, okay? So work on getting those elbows a little bit higher and those hands a little bit closer. Again, though, your hand entry is exactly where it needs to be. As we continue on here, we can see that we've got that breath. It's a little bit high. Okay, you're looking up here. Work on just keeping that head looking straight to the side. Don't let it come up quite so high to breathe. Good job of getting your head, though, down. That's excellent. Nice steady legs. Again, it's that right arm really is doing more of the straight arm recovery than the left arm. So that left arm needs to work a little bit better. Oh, I'm sorry. The, the left arm is having a bent, bent elbow. Right arm is a little bit of the straight arm recovery. So that, that right arm needs to get a little bit better just getting that elbow. Continue on. Again, great kick. Again, though, you can see way high head breathing. Your head position in the water is really good. So if you actually would just turn that head to the side instead of all the way around, you'd be so much better. Great fingertip. Absolutely love that entry. Again, you can see both goggles looking straight up. All right. So as we come into our turn here, good last stroke. Again, you see those feet are really tight together. Just keep those feet a little bit separated. But that streamline is incredible. Just wait for about two seconds before we start those dolphin kicks. What we want to see is we want to see you really on that stomach directly, not on that side. Good dolphin kicks there. First stroke without a breath. That looks great. Just try to keep your hips a little bit more in line with your body. You kind of could see where they kind of swivel from side to side. Keep those hips a little bit more straight. Okay. Great job, Sienna.